When we're camping, we normally bring an extra tent with us because we have a larger dog that can't climb up the stairs with us, obviously, he's old. So we ended up getting the annex to see if we can eliminate having that extra tent. It is not a light accessory. It is um, 42 pounds. Take that into consideration when packing. Okay. Oh, look, orange. Ah, this must be the flooring, which I didn't realize it came with the flooring. So that's awesome. Ugh. I like the color of the pole. I have not yet found the instructions. We got our stakes and ropes. <laughs> no instructions? So we didn't see any box, uh, instructions in the box. So we went online and it was right there on their website. Oh, okay. Done. Okay. This one side has the channel, which is this, has the same stuff as we used to, that's on this, these. And then the zipper is on the opposite, which is gonna actually zip right into the fly thing. Okay. Start by sliding this channel into this back channel. Problem with ours is the way ours is mounted, it's actually past the rail. We'll have to get something to protect these. So we actually pushed up on pushed up on this to give us a little bit of room, slid it in. Take this other end and then slide it in. Right here, these little nubs. This thing is gigantic. We got it all set up. Yes, it looks a little wonky, but that's because someone read the sizing wrong. Um, the actual height recommendation is 76 to 78 inches, and unfortunately ours is 68 so we're about 10 inches short but um i think it'll be i mean it's not gonna look perfect but i think it's gonna still be great to have that all the extra space because it's huge inside you want to get the roof line as tight as possible so you don't have any bunching up with it in case it rains so you may end up with a little extra material down at the side let's go check it out all four sides open up um First, these three have the netting so that you can have the flaps up and just the, the almost like a bug screeny on there. Lots, plenty of headroom, plenty of floor space. We'll definitely be able to get a dog in here. You can probably sleep a few people down in here too. So yes, it took us a while to set up this first time. You know, there wasn't instructions and we had to kind of figure it out. Um, I think once we're actually doing it at the campsite, maybe 10 to 15 minutes. Um, I don't know if I could do it by myself. Greg probably could, but I think two people is definitely a, a must have to make it go easier and a lot quicker. We're really looking forward to trying this out on our next camping trip and we definitely will be able to get our dog in there. Who knows, maybe even the porta potty, we'll see. If you like this video, hit the like button and we'll see you next time.